my loves and welcome to this vlog. It's gonna be a glow up, yes! We are glowing up. I feel like I'm in need of a full makeover in January because I feel like, I don't know, it's just been a long old time since I've had everything done. So I'm gonna get my nails done, I'm gonna get my eyebrows done, I'm gonna get my hair done, and then we're gonna do a little bit of shopping on the weekend because I've finally got the holiday booked. We're gonna go next week up and it's a bit last minute. And my hand is shaking, so I can apologise for the shaky footage because um, I've just been rushing around all morning. I basically just shot, shot a bit of content this morning. But I'm just about to leave for the hairdresser, so I thought I'd bring you along with me. Goodbye to the red hair, it is going, and we are going back brunette. I'll show you the pictures that I'm going to show to my hairdresser. I'm going to go like dark brunette with some lighter bits in it. Today we're going to take my extensions out and then dye my hair brown. And then I'll colour match to my new extensions and then I'm going to go back Friday and get them in. So it's not really often that I get all the things done at once, like my eyebrows, my nails and my hair, but it's just happened that they all come at once and I'm going away next week. So I thought it would be good to get this vlog up before I go and yeah, just thought we'd do a bit of a glow up together. Glow up in Jan, come at me. So I'm so excited to get rid of my hair only because I've loved it and I've loved having red hair but it just fades so fast. I told you guys before, I'm not gonna get into it, but yeah, it just fades a lot. I've got my roots, it changes color, like literally instantly. Like I feel like after three washes, it's a different color. And I really enjoyed the change, but I am ready to go back brunette and I'm ready to get a tan next week. So um, yeah, I'm just, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling happy. I'm feeling excited for this vlog. I hope you enjoy it. And yeah, let's go to the hairdressers. My extensions are out. So this is all my natural hair. I mean, it's still really thick and really long, but I just love having that extra bit of thickness in. So this is it before we're gonna dye it now. Um, I can't believe how thick it actually does look. <laughs> like, oh, okay, this is my hair. <laughs> but um, I'm gonna go brown now. These are the colors we picked out. So the new extensions are gonna be like a mixture of these three colors. And then we're also going to put through one of the lighter colours, I think is this, just a teeny tiny bit, um, just to get like those lighter bits coming through, I'll show you how it looks. Just like this. So the first stage, we've got, obviously I want lighter bits through it, so these are lifting um, my hair, I think this is like some sort of bleach in here, um, and we're going to lift these bits up to get like this colour on the round the face and then the rest is going to be dark now we have the brown on the ends and the back and then we're nearly done back to the house you can't really see the hair because of the light uh, we've got spotlights so it's a little bit awkward to see but we are back brunette <laughs> we're back to the brunette club We've had some little bits put in front, just some lighter bits, you can see them a little bit there. But I will show you uh, properly tomorrow in the light. So this is my actual hair. Um, and then Friday we're going to go back for my extensions. Um, we're having my nails on tomorrow as well, a bit of a pamper day, I'm really enjoying this week. <laughs> I have got to work in the morning though, so I will be up filming reels and editing before um, I go for the nails. The appointment is quite late, so I will catch you in the morning and show you a bit of then. We are on the way. London is so, so rainy, and windy and freezing. So I just wanted to put this big puffer jacket on to keep me, I don't know if you're gonna be able to hear this because the wind is so bad. So yeah, this is my outfit. This is a good a day as any to start the rebuilding of life. They've lasted amazing. Show you one hand at a time because I'm holding the camera, but I'll let you play. Morning, it is the next day, and we are on the way to the final hair appointment to get my extensions back in. I woke up this morning and washed my hair, and now we're on the way to go and get them done. I'm so excited. I just grabbed some dark chocolate rice cakes from Press. I haven't showed you my nails, but I'll show you when I sit down. But this is my little outfit of the day. Also carrying this huge bag because me and Gemma are going to shoot some uh, outfit pictures after. And carrying this bag in rush hour was not easy. <laughs> this is my, this is my natural hair. Yeah. This is 
it before it's like being cut in so a lot of hair but we're gonna cut it in now the sun <laughs> never see sun normally in london so let's appreciate it we're done it's so so lush like look at the color perfect perfect match can't tell that they're extensions this is the best thing about it look how long it is so lush literally like in all the mirrors looking at it feels so much better like it looks healthier it looks natural and i absolutely love this so long i'm so excited to like style it up so many different ways like this is my comfort zone like long hair just come in to have a quick lunch on the sauna in leon for me and gem i'm gonna be starving on rice so I've now come to meet Jem. The wind literally had me. It was so windy. And my hair's got all flat because the wind was just like so strong. My hair was flying everywhere. So now we haven't really got curls, but I do love the colour and stuff. I'll have to give it a bit of a refresh for tomorrow. But yeah, we just come to shoot some content now. We've come into a hotel to change. Jem is in the bathroom. And I'm on to my second outfit. This is from another stories. You'll see a picture on the Insta soon. So nice. <laughs> we just got a little cup of um, tea and coffee, and this is where we did a little pick. Is chairman? And is this new jumper? Uh, yeah, I got it. No, when did I get it? Before Christmas, but it's still in store. What is it? Another story. Another story. Yeah, and nice. it comes in black and camel, and I actually think I prefer it. Yeah, I like that. You can see my hair so much better here as well, yeah, like cool. in the light. But the wind did get me just now. Like yeah, the wind got all of us. <laughs> so windy, but um. I will show you obviously I always keep saying I'll show you when I get in or I'll show you the next thing and I'm always promising to show you in better light and stuff but I guess this is the best light I'm gonna get natural light but the, I am a bit windswept at the minute but I do love it okay we are on to the last change of the day and we have gone for I've got um, this new trench from H&M new in and just like a black uh, jumper with a little skirt from Abercrombie and my Fendi tights on and some Heine boots um, and then we're done. I'm gonna can't wait to go home. Nice cup of tea, dark, 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 dark chocolate rice cakes, and yeah, just have a little cutchy Friday night in. I'm done for the day. Yes, we are ready to go home. I've layered up. It's gone so cold. So cold. So cold, but we're ready. We're good. Gemma's gonna go to Leon. She's been talking about it all day. Got my Uggs on as well. And I'm gonna go home and have tea and biscuits. Oh. It is the next day, and we are in Selfridges in my little shop. I'm going to my next thing, so I've got a little bit of last minute makeup bits, and I really want to buy a beach bag, but it's so expensive. Selfridges is literally like a one stop shop for every single thing. Like, you can have a wig put on, you can have a massage, you can get your eyebrows done. It's just like anything you want, you come here. Okay, we got here a lot my house. We are in Tapas for Giza. We've got another plate to come with aubergine, but we always have one of these each because we love Tapas Bravas. Super cute in here, the tapas is really good, it's in Soho. I just got my eyebrows done. Sale on all the jewellery. I always wanted a pinky. That's cute because I actually really like that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> the pinky guy. What's his name? The one I've asked him about. Look at all these boots in the sale. I love them. I also like this little bag. Can't decide whether to get it. I think it's really cute, do you? What do you think? I'd get it. Would you? Yeah. 20 quid. My hairdresser told me to buy her head off for holidays, but I just don't know what can I do. I just don't know how to wrap it on my head. But I reckon I should buy it. Neil I'm more impressed. Lot my hair's gone all static now. But look, she's got it on. She looks good. Oh my god, we've fat we've got a mirror and we've done it the hair down we've just pinterested how to do it and now we're both really into it so massive nice. vibe now this is holiday goes, goes holiday central i can protect my scalp because i will burn my scalp whilst also we're looking chic imagine some gold hoop earrings <gasps> Brown. i'm buying it it's done yeah. hi loves i am in the house now i've just tried to put a light on like my ring light to finish this vlog because it's so dark even with the spotlights on you can't see anything so i thought i would show you what i got what i picked up today got some little bits just for holidays i feel like it's so nice to go and shop and when you know you've got something to look forward to all my makeup's come off it is shocking i've had to put my hair up 
Um, I hope I got enough footage of my hair, by the way. I know this is supposed to be a glow-up vlog, and we're ending it, and I'm not that glowed up. I'm aware of that, but in the natural light, I'm, I'm more glowed. I had my nails done. We did, like, a little pattern on them. I obviously showed you. just had my eyebrows done, which is why I've got, like, no makeup around this area. Just had them done in the Blink Brow Bar in um, Selfridges. I've not uh, penciled them in, but obviously when I pencil them in, they look a bit better. Obviously, I've had my hair done, but... Um, doesn't look great now, but because I've been playing with it all day, like my hands have made it a bit greasy. But anyway, I thought I'd show you what I picked up. So I got the little bag from Mango, and then noticed on the way home that there's all like brown bits on it, which is not ideal. I picked up the bra you would have seen. I think this is going to look so nice with a white shirt over it, just like a holiday vibe, shirt off the shoulder, stunning. Love that. That was in the sale as well. I uh, did for uh, $13.99 and it was 30s in a small. Then I picked up some nail varnish. This is from one of the stories. Um, it was £6 but I needed to paint my toes because I need them to match my hands. I was going to try and get my toes done but I hate showing people my toes. <laughs> I don't know if anyone else is like that. I'm like embarrassed of my toes a bit so I'm like oh, I don't want to go and get my toes out some way. I feel bad for the people who have to do the toes because I know they're not nice. So um, yeah. That's a little bit of a confession. And then I got these earrings from Mango, which I love. They remind me of designer ones. Like, how fab are they? They were 20 quid, which is quite a lot, but for like costume jewellery. But I just thought they're going to look so nice on holidays. This is a very holiday vibes haul. Um, but I'm leaving in two days. I'm so excited. And then I just got like a plain white tea, just because I've got stains all over mine, to be brutally honest with you. Um, and under the stories there's such nice cotton in there so I got a plain white tea and then my favourite purchase of the whole day was my headscarf I love it I'm so excited as soon as I got in I showed Claudio and I was like oh my god are you so excited for me to wear this in Italy this year like obviously my hair's up now but imagine I showed you anyway didn't I in the vlog like how I'm going to do it I'm going to try I'm going to watch loads of YouTube tutorials now on how to do them Oh, I'm so excited by this. Like, imagine it was gold hoop earrings and sunglasses. I'm going to take it to Italy this year. Um, it was £35, and Neilan was like, that's too spenny, but I was like, I've got to buy it. I'm going to be thinking about it. If I don't buy it, I'm going to be thinking about it, and I'm going to be wishing I had it. And my hairdresser told me to buy um, something to protect my hair. So, all in one protection. I bought this, you're going to laugh, on ASOS. That's not going to protect any of my hair, is it? Or my head, because it's got a hole in it. I love it. I mean, looking at it in the viewfinder, it's not giving with the dressing gown, but trust me, when I'm in Maldives, it will be giving. But <laughs> I actually can't take myself seriously. But I do think it'd be nice, like for pictures and stuff, maybe from the back. And it's nice to shade your face, but then it leaves all your head. And I'm always scared of getting sunstroke, obviously, because I've got a little bit of a health anxiety. So it's not really the ideal. I should have actually just bought a straw hat. But I do think it's cute. And then I just got a little ASOS order. So I would just open this to do because I can't really remember what I ordered. I ordered it a few days ago. Oh yeah, this one's nice. So it's just like really floaty, just nice to chuck on to go for like lunch or whatever. Um I think this was in the sale as well, super cheap. And it's like low cut and it's really, really long. And I love red on holidays. And again, this was a tall section, so I think I'm gonna keep this, I can tell already. I got in a UK 6, I think that's probably because it was the only one left. <laughs> and now it's kind of stretchy. So the yellow's going to go back and then I've got two pairs of earrings. Um, I've really struggled to find like gold hoops, like big ones. And um, I wanted like a really chunky gold bracelet to take away with me. Ooh, these are actually really nice. Oh, I actually really like them. I think they're going to be really nice on. And I find ASOS does good ones. Like, they're not, obviously, they're not, like, gold-plated. But I think they're going to be nice on. I've taken my earrings out because I'm going to get ready to chill out now. I'm going to take my makeup off. Ooh, I actually really like them. Like, I've got two rat and bow addresses. And on the rat and bow website, I don't know if I say that right, but on the website, the girl's got super chunky gold earrings in, and it looks so nice. So I wanted to recreate that because they just looked so good. I actually love them. They're so, so nice. Then I got these, which I think might be a bit match. I, I think I prefer the ones I got in. Um, I'll show you. They're a lot bigger. Um, I think they might be a bit over the top, to be honest. I like this because they're like shiny gold. And this is like, you can tell this is like a cheaper gold. It's like the 
it's hard to, t to sh explain but you can see like the color difference in it and i don't like this color as much because i think you can tell it's not gold plated i'll put this one in my other ear so you can see they're not heavy though which is good oh my god my makeup has come off completely i'm looking at myself i'm like oh my gosh I did put it on this morning though, and I've been like, and I had my eyebrows and so she took half of it off. I don't love them, do you? I think I'll have to try them both on. Uh, Neelam's gonna come over tomorrow, um, so I will show her tomorrow and then she'll help me decide whether to keep them. And that is it, that's my little mini haul at the end of the day. I had such a nice shopping day, it was really nice to see Neelam because I haven't seen her for so, so long. Um, it's been like nearly a month obviously because we were both sick and stuff over Christmas. It's been ages since I saw her so it was a nice little catch up. We had some tapas together and now I'm going to take all my makeup off, have a nice cup of tea and some biscuits again. It's my nightly routine. I might have something to eat because I'm still a little bit, I'm not hungry but you know when you can eat again. So I might have something a little to eat as well and I bought, oh I bought two new lipsticks. Let me show you them before you go. I'll show you these super super quickly. Peach stock by MAC has been discontinued, I was devastated. So I tried to find a really similar one. This is called Beige Beige Dew from Bobbi Brown. And it is so, so nice on. So I will be, I'll link that over on Instagram and I'll pop it in the description as well. It's so good, I'll probably be wearing that instead of Peach stock now as like an everyday one. And then I picked up this one as well. It's called Cre Creme Nude, Creme de Nude, Creme de Nude. And it's just like a light pink, looks really good on. It's more like a glossy, clear-y one, but looks nice over a good lip liner. And then I just picked up a um, another one of these because my pot rouge has run out. It's just called Pot Rouge for Lips and Cheeks. I don't ever put it on my lips, I just put it on my cheeks as a blush and I love it. And there's the um, colour Fresh Melon. And I literally used it all up and I needed to get another one. Because I cannot go on holidays without this, it's so, so nice. And that is it. That is my mini haul finished uh, the second time round. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. If you did, let me know in the comment section below. Sorry it was a little bit disjointed. I hope I can do better next time. Keep improving. I hope you all have a lovely day and I'll catch you next Sunday. Bye.